We are all uh, very excited to see this big heart beating in this human. Uh, uh, this big heart has performed so far very well, uh, even beyond our expectations. We have not seen any signs of rejection. We have uh, modified 10 genes in this, in this big heart. Uh, four genes were knocked out, three of them responsible for producing antibodies that causes rejection. So those three genes were knocked out. And then one gene was knocked out to control the growth of pig and its organs. There are hundreds and thousands of people all around the world who are waiting for the organ. And unfortunately, just like this patient, may not qualify for an organ transplant. So uh, with, if xenografts uh, become readily available and are allowed to be put in in these patients, all these patients could receive a, a, a heart or any other organ from these uh, modified pigs and uh, would be able to, we would be able to save their lives. You know, it is a game changer because, uh, you know, now uh, not, uh, we will have these organs readily available. If this works, and, you know, and I hope it will work, uh, we'll have these organs available. We, we, we can, you know, we have the technique of genetically modifying. So if there are more tweaking required for, for modifying the genes, we, can, we, we, will, we will be able to do that. And, you know, can, can you know, customize basically the heart for or the organ for the patient.